This video shows how to use Stepmaster for the analysis of step drawdown aquifer pumping tests. From the file menu, I can select an example data set. This view shows my data and each of the steps. From the edit menu, I can edit site information. This is information displayed in the graphs and reports. I can edit the aquifer parameters. This is the aquifer thickness and other information. And then also the pumping rate for each step. You can have up to 12 steps in your pumping test analysis and this can include recovery data. I can go to time and drawdown and this gives me my time values and the water level. I enter them in groups of 10. I can also import this data. From the file menu, I select import and single column or multiple column data. The file you're going to import is a tab delimited text file. Other videos have more detailed information on how to import data logger files into the aquifer test analysis software. The view menu is where I can view my graphs and the analysis methods. I have graphs such as semi log and analysis methods such as Eden Hazel, Hantush Beershank and Bursoy Summers. Each of those is described in another video. From the options menu, I have some options. Eliminate duplicates allows me to reduce my data set size by eliminating duplicate water level values. Eliminate alternates allows me to reduce my data set size by eliminating every other water level value. Units allows me to select the units for my display. If one of the units you want is not listed, you can provide your own custom unit. The language option allows me to set language for the reports and graphs. If English is not your desired language, you can provide labels in another language. I can also select various options for the graphs, including fonts and colors. That includes this introduction to Stepmaster. Be sure to look for videos with more detail on other topics.